Hello everyone! What is up? In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the new-ish, it's not very new, but it's new enough, game that is basically a PUBG clone slash Fortnite clone slash H1Z1 clone slash any other game that has been around in the PC kind of community that uh, does battle royale type game modes or whatever. Um, that came out smooth, <laughs> but um, yeah, so this is called Rules of Survival. There are many others like this on the App Store, Android Store, basically any mobile store. Uh, they are free to play, which is very cool. Um, didn't cost me anything, and um, that's one thing I want to mention before I actually start talking about this game, is that it's cool that they're able to do all this um, and have the game be free and on mobile. Now, I'm guessing they have some kind of system in with microtransactions where it's like pay to win almost, but I d haven't really noticed it in the couple games that I played. This is actually my first game playing it though, so I might be pretty bad. Actually, I know I'm pretty bad because if I remember this gameplay correctly, there's a pretty embarrassing part that I'm going to leave in. I'm just going to leave it in. Who cares? But yeah, right here, as you can see, just like Fortnite and any other game mode in that little genre you spawn in through some aircraft carrier it's usually different on a lot of games but right here you just spawn in there it's a pretty big map for a mobile game i didn't think that it'd be this big of a map but yeah 120 people as well which is just crazy to think about how far mobile games have come in general but uh yeah, as, as I said before, there are a lot of games like this on the App Store. There's one called Knives Out um, and many others that I don't remember the name to. And it seems like all of them are made by Japanese people. I'm not sure if this one is, but there's a lot of grammatical errors in English that I don't think an English company or English person that made it would have done. So I'm guessing some foreign, I'm guessing Japan, I don't know, Japanese developers or something. But it looks like they're capitalizing on PUBG's success. And one thing I want to mention is that this game is not actually bad. Um, I do bad in this gameplay, but uh, just as far as the game goes, for a free-to-play, you can't really have too many gripes, especially in mobile game. But for what it is, it's not bad. Um, the aiming is a little bit terrible, but you're going to get that on any other mobile game where you're using a touch screen to shoot instead of like a controller or a mouse and keyboard so that's kind of the problem but honestly if everyone's playing on even ground it shouldn't matter even worse I was playing this on an iPhone so I feel like if you play it on an iPad or some tablet or, or anything else you'll get a major advantage because obviously you're getting a bigger field of view um, Objects don't seem to load in too well. Um, you can't really see people from too far out. And the scopes are just crazy. I don't know why people would need scopes like that. And in this gameplay, I actually didn't find myself scoping in at all. So I just kind of treated it as a Fortnite um, simulator. And uh, they do have scopes and stuff. As you see in the top middle corner. Not even, just dead in the middle see a little crosshair thing that looks like the one on your screen that's where you can look in I do look in a couple times but I'm using a um an eight time scope for some reason <laughs> I don't know but right here I get the headshot and these blue little square things are where you can actually loot and you can actually fold them so they don't get in your way I don't realize this until like really late in this game but, uh, yeah, I do kill a couple people in this house. One thing I didn't notice is that the storm circle is actually pushing into where I spawned at, at the training grounds. Um, so I get a lot of people really quickly. And I don't think every game goes like that. But, I mean, it is 120 people and the maps aren't huge. So I'm guessing that um, that's just kind of the normal thing. Uh, just amplified because, you know, everyone's pushed to me. Um, I do end up dying after like two more kills in this video just because I'm running out trying to find people and I get shot from behind. So is the way of any survival game like this, you know, shit happens, especially when you're playing solo. 
Um, they do have squads and stuff, which I was kind of uh, excited to see. I might try that out later. I'm guessing there will be a revive feature just like any other Battle Royale game. So that might be fun and interesting to see how that kind of works. But yeah, they do fit a lot of stuff. They have a backpack. They have weapon mods, weapons themselves. And this is a part where <laughs> I'm actually kind of embarrassed. I'm moving and shooting an assault rifle and I barely kill her. She almost killed me. And yeah, that's pretty embarrassing. But uh, yeah, I'm not very good at uh, mobile game shooters. Um, these aren't just the types I play, but I'm interested in the series um, genre itself. I play a lot of Fortnite and stuff, so just kind of want to try it out. And honestly, I went into it thinking this game would be horrible because it's a mobile game, and usually mobile games that copy big games like Rocket League or anything, all those imitations suck or horrible and just laughable. But this is actually like a game where. I could see people playing it for a while and having fun and it's free so I think if you haven't downloaded it yet already I would try it rules of survival on the app store or whatever you play and yeah I'm gonna give this game like an 8.5 out of 10 I wouldn't give it a 9 because I don't think I would play it that much that's just me but for what it is as a free-to-play mobile game it's pretty cool um, how they're doing this and right here I actually do get shot from behind. I realize he's behind me, but as I'm about to turn, he takes me out. So anyways, guys, that's the video. Thank you for watching. It's been Glider from Glider to Aiming. Peace out.